All right, greetings and welcome to my channel and to another video. Today we're going to be reviewing these new beer glasses. Here they are. The major advantage here, they hold the cold. We'll be putting them to the test if you're interested in upgrading to something a little uh, fancier, if you will, or something that uh, just is a little more well-made, less likely to break compared to your regular, you can see there on the left, a regular glass uh, that I keep frosted in the freezer at all times. So we're going to be putting these new ones to the test. As always, I'll pop links down below if you're interested. But here we are. Let's go ahead and get them frozen first. Now, a regular glass you'd keep in the freezer kind of around the clock until you're ready to pour it out of beer, right? Uh, these, I'll t teach you a little trick here. You can do that, but these uh, this patented liquid that's in between is extremely cold. And so we're going to crack open a beer and pour it in there. And uh, basically, you'll have the option of, you know, keeping this in the freezer, uh, you know, until you're ready to drink. Or you could pop it in the freezer maybe two hours or maybe one hour or three hours before you're ready to pour your beer, depending on the type of beer that you are pouring. Because as you may know, beers are best served at certain temperatures. So if you're looking for a really, really, really cold beer, you know, IPA, something, some type of cold lager, uh, you just keep it in the freezer and... It'll be pretty good, I think. Now, for the purposes of this test, it's not scientific by any means. We're going to be doing a temperature test. You see on the right there, we've got a regular glass mug. And then on the left there, the new mug that we uh, that I just uh, received. And we'll pop in the, uh, the little thermostat. And you can see 34 degrees. Kind of goes down to 30 degrees with the regular glass. And then... Check this out. That patented liquid in between the glass actually not only keeps it cool, but actually works to chill and drop the temperature of the beer. Because obviously that beer can that I just poured was not 26 degrees. That's below freezing, right? That would have been a frozen can. It was just right out of the refrigerator. So whatever degree that was, maybe 40 degrees or 35 degrees or 37, whatever that was. But you can see it's actually working to reduce the temperature. So not only does it have the ability to preserve the cold, it also has the ability to drop the temperature once you pour it. And that's what kind of it looks like. Obviously, that was a crappy pour, so there's a lot of, you know, head on that pour, but whatever. Don't judge me. All right, let's transfer it back in from the regular glass to the new beer mug, beer glass, and give you a nice view. It's got a silicone base, so you can put it down on the hard cement like that, and it won't crack, so that's a really nice feature. And you can actually see ice forming. It's almost like too cold, right? So again, if it is too cold for your liking, if you don't like the ice forming, you can uh, opt to not put it in the freezer, uh, you know, several hours before maybe one or two and call it good, right? It, so in other words, it's all dependent upon how cold you get that patented liquid in between the glass, right? All right, we're going to actually leave it out in the sun here and we'll do a temperature check. But let's pour ourselves a new fresh beer with that second mug there. And you remember what that temperature was going in. We can assume that was the same as the, the first beer that we saw. And check it out. After about 10 minutes, it's still holding around 29 degrees. I love it overall. A nice little set if you are interested in upgrading. Hopefully this has helped you out. Thanks.